Hey guys, what's up? It's Brett, um, and today I am going to be talking about the whole entire marriage equality situation that happened on Friday. Um, I know a lot of people made their videos on Friday because, you know, it was super fucking exciting, but I was just like way too excited and way too emotional to actually want to make a video on Friday, I guess. I was just like, oh my god, I don't even know how to express how I was feeling, really. It's been like one of the best days for me ever because of what happened on Friday. Um, just like knowing that I can go to any state and be like, hey, I want to get married. And they can't be like, no, you can't do that because, well, guess what, bitch? I can now. And it's just like such a good feeling to be able to say that. Anyways, I wanted to wait a couple days before I actually like gave my reaction and told you guys how I was feeling about it because I wanted to see what other people had to say about it. Like the people who were against it and what they would have to say about it because I wanted to like react to it and stuff. From what I've seen, a lot of people were like, oh, well, fags, oh, fags, that's us. We can't reproduce still, but like, I mean, we can, but not like, obviously not with each other, but there's different ways to do it. And that goes for gays and lesbians, transgender, anybody in the LGBTQ community. And it's ridiculous that people are trying to bring that, like put us down because we couldn't do that. Cause we can, it's just not the same way they can. I don't know why people would be like against that, like us having kids in general, because if we're, even if it's a, like, even if it's adoption, if we want a kid, we have to like really want it, you know? It's not like something that accidental that happens. It's not just like a random thing for us. It'd be something that you'd really have to like think about and be like, okay, we're gonna do this. I also don't really get how people are always like, well, you know, God wouldn't like that. God didn't create fags. The God I know made me the way I am. I didn't choose this lifestyle at all. And it's not something that you can just be like, oh, hey, you don't just wake up one day and you're like, oh, yeah, I'm going to like guys. I'm going to like guys today. Yep. I'm not straight anymore. It's like a self-discovering thing in your brain. This is just like, nope, nope. You don't like girls. Stop. Stop. And then you look at guys and you're just like, oh, this is like a really big fucking step for us. It's a really huge step in the right direction for the gay community and for America in general. It's so weird to actually like see that happening. And I know how big of a deal it is for like the older generation of gays too. Cause like what they had to go through when they were growing up and like when they were coming out, how a big of a deal it was. Like it's still a big deal today, but like back then it was like crazy. Like if you were like, you'd get gay bashed here in America like all the time. And I know that still happens here, but which is okay. Which is fucking terrible by the way. Um, but like, it's definitely not as bad as it was like way, you know, like generations ago. I'm sure that they are really, really excited about this too, because they have gone through all that shit and all that fighting and all that struggle. And now they finally got to see the day where they can say that they can get married wherever the fuck they want. And that's pretty fucking awesome. I just said fuck like eight times. I'm so sorry. I need to stop cussing, man. I cuss way too much in videos. We can all get married, which is awesome. Um, and there are also a lot of other things that are available to us now that we can legally marry. It's like we are starting to actually be treated like equals and be treated like the normal people we are, you know? It took so long for this to actually happen, but the good thing is it actually did happen and we got to be alive to see that. Maybe people will start actually realizing that being gay is not a choice. Being gay is something that makes a person different, but they're still a human, just like you. People need to get that through their heads and they don't understand that. When people tell me that being gay is a choice, I'm always, I always ask them, I'm always like, okay, well, I bring in ice cream, because one, I love ice cream, and two, it's actually a really good point, because you can be like, well, what do you, what ice cream do you like better? It's like vanilla or chocolate? And then they'll be like, they'll say a flavor, they'll be like vanilla, and I'll be like, okay, why? And they'll be like, I don't know, it just tastes better. And I'm like, okay, well, that's, the exact same way about me and how I like guys. You can ask them the same thing too about them liking girls, but well, why do you like girls? And they'll be like, uh, well, cause I think they're hot. And it's like, well, <laughs> hello, like same for me, but with dudes. But then they'll be like, well, that's not right. And I'm like, 
how do you know what's right? How can you say something's right and I can't say something's right? Like, it doesn't really matter what you say. Like, your opinion does not mean shit to me about my life and who I, you know, who I love and what gender I'm attracted to. Like, it's not even, it really wasn't even my decision. Like, it's just the way I am. And I don't get how people don't understand that. All right, guys. Well, that's the end of this week's video. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And also, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, also, make sure to check out my social media links. They'll be in the description below. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time. Bad mind, just